I think we lost it. Yeah. So keep a low profile and we just walk through the woods and we try to find a safe place. Idiots. Can't believe it. So what do we do? What do you think you did? How did the alarm trigger? I don't know, man. Did you pull the lever by accident or anything? What lever? There's like this greenish lever, lever you know, we made sure we to pull all the levers except for the green one so the alarm wouldn't trigger. I thought we were supposed to pull all of the levers. No, dude. I I told you over and over, man. Come on. Yeah. Now look at we we got to get new identities. We got to get new everything, man. We got to get out of the country. Come on, man. What about your boy James? Can he help us? I don't know. I he might be able to help us, man, but you got us in the sticky situation. Look at look at my man freaking Romero being so mad at us. David, man, come on! My boy James can't, like, get us out of this all the time. Stop. Wait. Stop. You too. Shut up. Alright, I'm gonna make a couple of calls. Alright, so we can lay low for a while. Alright, get off the grid and let all this clear up. Alright? Alright, uh, good thing my boy and Romero got stop, me. Stop. And listen, we're gonna, since we all look like high school students, we're gonna go lay low at a high school for a couple of months until all this clears up, alright? If this happens again, it'll be your head. Yeah, hey, Tommy. Yeah, Tommy, what's going on? All right, listen, uh, slight change of plans. These two idiots messed up, and uh, I need a place to lay low. Can you help me out? Yeah, sure, sure, fine. All right, look, uh, all I need are three fake school IDs, all right? Uh-huh. All right, yeah, that's good. No. So what do you want, man? Oh, nothing much. Just thinking about wiping you two from the family. What? What? Mm -hmm. What? For yep. what? You two are compromising the job. Ryan. Ryan, what, what are we going to do, Ryan? Ryan, what are we going to do, Ryan? We just killed him. Dude, you can't think like that. Okay? Just calm down. All right, everything's going to be fine. Is it? Is it? What are we going to do? The Mafia is after us now. You can't be talking like that right now, man. You were a part of it. You know we had to do what we could. He was gonna kill us. First off, we gotta get rid of the body. There's no way. If we get caught by the police before the Mafia come after us, then it's not even worth it. How are we gonna, are we gonna get rid of the body? Just dump, just dump it into the ditch near the woods. I have a plan. So I have some contacts up in Canada. There's a guy I know called Kyle. He's in the Sosoro family. He's been there for two generations now. He's a friend of my grandfather. He can get us in. Under his protection, I believe that we have a chance of survival. I guess that's the only option we have. But the thing is, he doesn't let someone in the family that easy. We're gonna have to offer him some good amount of money. Probably all the money we have. Well, what can I say? It's a, it's a sacrifice to be paid. Well, let's go dump the body. It was nice knowing you. Yeah. Oh, it was bloody. I know, bro. He was pretty bloody. And he was heavy as well. So, yeah. My uh, Romero blood on me. You might want to get that off. We don't need no FBI looking dude catching us after this. So, yeah. So, what are you going to do now? I'm going to go and, you know, uh, call up the Canadians a bit, you know, and uh, sort things out. And then we'll go our different ways. We have the different 